Hi and welcome. It's Monday. I have a weird relationship with Mondays because on one hand, I'm like, I feel extremely empowered. I feel powerful. I feel ready to kick asses. It's a new week. I can do whatever I want this week. I'm gonna be productive. I'm gonna do everything that I want. And on the other end, I'm like, oh God, there's a whole week in front of me. I've been trying to see the bright side of things lately. So let's embrace the productive kick that Mondays give me because for the past couple of weeks I've been slacking, meaning that I had, and I don't even want to say the energy because I had the energy, but I couldn't bring myself to do anything and I felt terrible. I was like, why am I wasting so much time? Like, yeah, it's okay if I don't do things if i take a break it's okay you know like you don't have to always be productive it's fine if you take a break i wanted to do things but i wasn't able to do them i was kind of paralyzed like last week especially i was like no no, no things need to change like i need to get my shit together like my life it's all over the places i need to get a grip on it you know i was like somewhere I have to start and I kind of thought maybe I could create some kind of challenge for myself just to go just to get back on track just to get back on my feet and to um I guess having a new structure I used notion I love my notion so I wrote down on my notion like things that I want to change and how I can change them and how I can get better and uh, basically what I want to change is I want to spend less time on social media both on my phone and on my computer um, I want to be more active uh, simply moving my body like doing yoga stretching I already do Pilates twice a week um, I don't know go out for a walk be confident in what I do and what I put out on the world be proud of it, be proud of myself and everything that I achieve, stuff like that and be less distracted and then I wrote down how, how I can change that and I was like, put my phone away from where I am working I uh, can't really do that with my computer but with that I'm just gonna force myself not to go on social media on my computer have a better routine so having I guess knowing what to do during the day I kind of need to have a routine I kind of have to know what I'm supposed to do and what I'm not supposed to do uh, because it kind of helps me to not waste time and uh, scroll on social media and also I came up with eight things that I want to do that I want to implement in my life I have wake up before eight I usually wake up before eight the thing is that i don't really struggle with waking up early uh but i struggle with getting out of bed uh be active in some way every day then eat healthy i guess pay attention to what i'm eating with every meal having my carbs my proteins um my veggies and uh, fats another thing i I don't know why, but I forget to eat. If I'm doing something and I'm really into it, I forget. And then I stop for a minute and I'm like, whoa, my stomach, it's screaming for food. So I also have to remind myself to snack here and there during the day. Read 10 pages every day. Then I wanna have a one no social media day. Then I wanna have a day each week where I take a few hours for myself to do things that I love doing, such as baking, cooking, uh, painting, drawing, uh, going out and take pictures, and one pamper day per week, which is, I guess, my me day. So I take care of myself mentally and physically, so skincare, solo dates, this is pretty much what I want to kind of implement in my new routine. I'm gonna try and do this kind of new routine for, I guess, a month just to see 
if it's working, if it's not working. And after a month, um, I'm just gonna see if I can keep going. Honestly, this is a mess, but I guess it's a little bit more clear than having everything inside my head. So I did this. I kept basically the mornings free so that every day I kind of have space to put things. You could easily do this on like Google Calendar. Today it's simply not a good day. My hair, it's not working. Clothes are not fitting in the right way. Sun, it's not outside. <laughs> it's raining again. And I have no willpower to do absolutely anything. I don't know what it is. I might draw today a bit. I feel a bit a, a rush of art incoming. So I might do that. I don't know. Now, I took a break for the first time since like 10.30 and I just realized that it's almost 12.30 like I've been drying for, half an hour, for, for two hours, almost and my stomach is growling, like I'm, I'm starving that's what I meant yesterday when I said that I forget to eat because I'm extremely focused on what I'm doing but let me show you what I've been doing for two hours so I've been doing this which is how I see songs you've never heard of it it's called synesthesia it's pretty cool basically your brain mixed up two senses this is literally how I see the songs this are the title of the songs and this is how I see the songs as you can see right it's a pretty heavy theme i haven't picked up a color in so long that i'm honestly shook that this this happened oh my god <laughs> i just realized that i put them kind of in in order <laughs> why but yeah i'm definitely not finished i have five songs left this is a mess but I love it. visualization, meditation for the April moon. And Yesterday I wrote so much. I had this sprint of inspiration that I genuinely had to stop because it was late and I had to eat. 
um, otherwise I would have kept going. Tomorrow I'm getting one of my last two wisdom teeth <laughs> left removed and uh, I'm a bit stressed out but not for the procedure itself, it's the, I'm definitely more concerned about the post procedure. Today I'm taking things very slowly. Thanks for being here. Thanks for watching. Give a like, subscribe. See you in the next one.